Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. So I got a request on how to download mods. So we're on Nexus, I've logged into my account, and I'm going to try Smart Crop Bubbles to see if I can get this to work. So when you pull up the screen, you're going to have to go to Files, and when that loads, you're going to scroll down, and I usually just go with the top file and hit Manual Download, full of other mods. One of those I'm going to need, but I'm going to go ahead and just download this one. So you download. I usually just use the slow down mode. When that's downloaded, I'm going back into the original files page so that I can get the link to download that other mod that I'm going to need. GMCM options. So I'm going to repeat the same process. Click the drop down and click files. And then I'm going to scroll down and just pick the one that's at the top of the list and hit manual download. And then I'm going to scroll down and go to slow download. And then once that's done downloading, we can open up Smappy and install the mods. And then I'm going to hit Mod Manager, Install Mod. And then I'm going to go ahead and select the GMCM Options one first. And then I'll repeat the process and install the other mod. You don't need to unzip the files or anything, just install mod. And once it says it's installed, we can try and test it out make sure it's going to work. And I went ahead and just deleted a mod that I didn't need anymore that aren't working properly. And now we click start game. I apologize that it didn't go landscape so you can actually see the <laughs> rest of this in full screen. But as you can see, my Smappy is loading and there's no red text or anything, so everything's loading correctly. And then we will open up the generic mod configuration menu and just look at a couple of things. Settings in your mods and everything. I just turn some things on or off, hit save and close, and then you go ahead and load into your game. Loading your mods, it's going to take a while, but after that you should be good to go. And I do plan on making a video on the configuration of how my controls are set up so that it's easier to play in mobile. And so you can see that the little bubbles are working, so it's showing me the open tilled soil right here. I was kind of confused, I'm like, what's planted here? <laughs> Nothing but it's just the tilled soil. And then you can see I have strawberries planted as well. So it just kind of gives you a little thing that tells you what the plant is, which could be really helpful if you're growing a bunch of mixed seeds and stuff. So I also intend on making videos on the mods that I'm currently using and the ones that work. I do intend on looking into Stardew Valley Expanded and making another list of all the mods that are compatible. I have successfully done it before, so I'm sure I can do it again. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye!